Hey, this is a video for 100,000 views on YouTube, and so I'm giving away a free Roku player. This is a Roku 2 XS, so it's the top of the line, and it is one of the best Roku players that you can find. Thanks for watching, and enjoy. So this is a quick unboxing that I'll do for you real quick. It comes in a standard brown box, um, straight from Roku, and it comes with these items inside this brown box. It has a, the Roku um, Get Started Guide. It also has the Roku Warranty and all that good stuff. But who cares about that? Put that to the side. Down here, you have the Roku XS, which is the highest of the all the Rokus. It's the one that has Wi-Fi and all that good stuff with it. With the XS, you have the remote that has a gyration in it where it will allow you to play Angry Birds as well. So inside this accessories box it has the, the video cables so that you can hook up your red, yellow, and white. Frankly I don't know who uses those anymore. Power adapter and batteries for the remote. I'll show you the peripherals of the Roku, what it has on the back. It has an HDMI port, it has a micro SD port, it also has the Ethernet and the power and the AV out and then you turn it to the side and it has USB for additional movies that you might find the front has no ports just a white light and there you have it the Roku XS so these are pretty easy to hook up um, you simply grab your HDMI plug it in the HDMI port your Ethernet I prefer to go wired over wireless though this does support wireless I prefer wired so there's your ethernet and your power and you'll see that your Roku's on by the white light that turns on pretty easy so you select your connection whether wired or wireless comes up detects everything um, says an updates available update is applied and now it restarts gives you a little screensaver that, that bounces Roku a couple times just to let you know that it's booting up and that everything's good with it we'll jump right into how this works it's good to have a computer next to you as you set this up as you have your code that's available that you go to your, the Roku site enter the code it asks you to set up a user account or if you already have one like I do then you just enter your account information accept the terms of service and then you go to their apps page where they have the apps where you can click and it'll install directly onto your Roku player so this will update your channels with that channel list that we were just talking about these are the channels that are in my account and including the good old Angry Birds game so once you're done it's ready for you to start streaming so you click OK to get start streaming and you're done so this is the welcome screen and there you have it so this is the main screen that you'll see with your Roku as you can see your Roku remotes like this and you just use your navigational arrows and you can go to anything from Pandora if you want to listen to music on your TV and have it play through your surround sound in your house you just come here to one of your stations that you already have and simply select it and it goes like that. You can give it your thumbs up, you can give it thumbs down, skip it, pause it, it's good stuff. So you jump out of that and you come back down over here to your uh, main screen. You can get your UFC fights. So this is UFC TV and basically what it'll provide is a place for you to your UFC fights where you can even do the pay-per-view fights and basically you'll come up here to any kind of live events that are going on and you'll be able to pay for them right here on your Roku instead of going through the cable company. They have the Fight Library, they have uh, free videos that you can watch on here. The Fight Library, you pay about a dollar a video to watch the previous fights. These are all the free videos that they provide, and it's just the upcoming stuff that you can see with uh, UFC. Pretty simple, easy stuff. And it looks just like you were to watch it on regular TV. So that's the UFC channel. Um, I won't go over too much more. Um, 
the X-Factor channel if you like to watch the X-Factor. If you already have HBO, then you can have an HBO Go account. MLB TV is for your MLB account. Crackle is Sony's version of Hulu where it gives all the Sony movies that are available online with uh, minimal commercial blips in between. Uh, it's, a, it's a pretty good service and it has quite a few movies as you can see. So if you wanted to watch the sixth day, you just simply select it and click the play button and it brings you the sixth day. Okay. So it's a, it's also good for kids. It has the Disney Channel and it retrieves the stuff from the Disney Channel and, and brings you all kinds of new stuff. If you have kids and they like radio Disney or music videos, this is a perfect channel. So you come over here and, and this will do your Amazon. If you have an Amazon Prime account, it will stream your Amazon Instant Videos. So you can come over here to your uh, TV shows that you want to watch on your Amazon and it will load anything that you have in your library such as Heroes is in mine, and you just click that you want to resume it, it'll go out, grab it, have your little quality meter here at the bottom, and it'll give you full HD quality in seconds. So that's Amazon, you have your, your Angry Birds that you can play on the TV, uh, Flickster for upcoming movies and things of that nature, new on DVD coming soon or you can watch things that are now in theaters and get your trailers and previews and things of that nature. Pretty good stuff. A lot of people use this uh, player for their Netflix which also has a pretty nice interface and you can search through it and retrieve your stuff that's in your instant video queue or you can add new things to your queue and uh, experience everything in HD. So for an example, uh, one of their programs, like you can see it says here that it's in HD, so you simply cl click it, select it, and it'll go out and get the stream and resume playing. It'll retrieve it right down here at the bottom, and then it'll give you the little HD that says HD quality. So there's a, just a little example of how you can use this Roku, and this Roku is going to the hundredth person that writes a comment on this YouTube channel, and it is going to them for free, nothing paid, and it, and it will come from from me to you free, just for watching my YouTube videos. Thanks and enjoy. So again, to win this Roku, all you do is leave a comment down below. Subscribe would be appreciated. And as the 100th person leaves their comment, I will contact them via the YouTube channel and ask for their address, and they will get this free Roku 2 XS player. Now, this is a streaming device. It, if you want more of a, a complete solution, then check out my other videos on an HTPC that will provide you with DVR functions for recording over there, HD channels, or even with your uh, cable uh, subscriptions, you can do it with a, an HD Home Run Prime. So check out my other videos that I have down here on YouTube and you'll see that I have uh, multiples that have the HTPC that you can put a computer behind your TV and it provides for a more complete solution where you can have all this plus the functions of a DVR with recording, play, stop, rewind, all that good stuff. Subscribe and comment below. Good luck.